Well hello everyone and welcome back to the Sons of the Forest and today we are gonna start building a new base on the best location that you can find on the entire game because that location it is a little bit special at least for me so let's just jump straight away right over there and I will show you exactly why it is that location the best location that you can even find Okay, I think that here we are, finally, so let's just land over here. I'm not really entirely yet sure, but we're gonna see. Okay, let's put this glider away. Now, let's just check. I am on the right spot. Yes, I am exactly on the right spot, and this is basically the best location that you are gonna find in the entire game. Uh, the reason why this location it is so perfect because it does have everything you are gonna ever need it. And of course some skeletons uh, they are already saying hello. Uh, no big deal. Obviously you are gonna have all resources basically around. And when I am speaking of resources, a lot of animals, a lot of stones if you want to build it with stones, no big deal. It is kind of perfect location to make some kind of cliff side base or something like this. Also, you're gonna have a water, and look at that, speaking of water, you're gonna find some fish inside, even it is winter, and this is pretty much damn rare, and on the top of that, this location basically it is so located, if I do look at the map, uh, near that cave, that is on the top of that hill, uh, I mean that cave with... Uh, with 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 uh, pickaxe and okay some visitors i need to deal with that little fingers before i start building i hoping kelvin he's gonna reach me quickly because okay he's a bit late okay some babies already here what is wrong oh, these babies are so annoying okay we done with this speaking of babies Okay, a nice welcome. And on the top of that, just uh, uh, I was uh, I was talking. Uh, this location it is uh, basically pretty much them easy to defend because uh, you are protected over here. You have water, so they cannot swim. Obviously, they can probably cross that side. Uh, but only things you need to protect. <laughs> the only thing. Something is going wrong uh, currently. Probably, I'm not sure. Uh, the only way you need basically to protect it is uh, basically right over here. So this is the only way they, they can attack your base. Ma Jesus Christ! This baby! How many? Okay, I need to clear this area apparently, because I don't see nothing. Obviously it's winter, it is a bit, uh, it is a, bit a mess. I do have some armor. Oh, uh, let's just skin at you. Uh, so I think that first things I'm gonna do, we're gonna make uh, ourselves a safe. I just want to find one spot that we can save probably here. It is a nice place. I can probably slip over here. I'm gonna place a tent down over here. Yeah, exactly what I needed. Okay, make a safe. Uh, now, obviously, we are gonna start uh, building with uh, stones, and for beginning, I'm gonna start make a deadly maze slash wall slash entrance to the base uh, that is gonna be located basically right over here somewhere. It's probably here. It's gonna be damn okay. Probably yes. Now, oh, I'm hoping, obviously, that Kelvin is gonna reach me really soon. Because otherwise... It's not gonna be really so easy to build all of this. And I don't need four of them. Obviously, I build it without animation right now. And let's just try to get... Right to the... Over there, I think that this is gonna be pretty much... Oh, Kelvin, you're already here! You know something? I will have some work for you. Uh, first of all, we are gonna make... 
some holders for stones and for 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 well, I just built some holders for Kelvin. Stone storage. I'm gonna place a couple of this. Finish that for me, okay. I saw a couple of cannibals over there. Obviously we are gonna be a little bit busy in the first days. Virginia, she is already operating. Okay, that one it is a little bit higher up, but that should not be really such a problem. Hello Virginia. And obviously I want to line up all these uh, stones uh, before I move actually to the grid. Uh, because he has building on non flat area with stones. Uh, it might be that it's gonna cause some problem. I'm not sure about that. Oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> Leave Calvin alone. Calvin, buddy. Hey, okay. Thank you for some sticks. Uh, they are very active these cannibals here. Huh? Oh, thank you for some bones and sticks. Calvin he is still kind of working with uh, with this one. I still try to line up all these stones which is obviously not really so easy especially on not flat area just like this one. You kind of need to work around a bit but we are getting over there. And I'm facing already some other problems on this side basically because this area it is a bit all uh, elevated. So to get around this point, yeah, this is something that I do need to do with uh, wood and I will gonna try to replace after that with stones. Obviously there is nothing really more that I can do at this point. Uh, it is what it is, but yeah, I need to mess around a bit just to figure it out if I can place the wall over here at the end. Uh, we're gonna see how this is gonna end up. Uh, Virginia, I must tell you, I am a bit worried about you. <laughs> I don't know what is wrong with Virginia. She is doing like so already for, I don't know, five minutes. Uh, I don't know, she's sitting or... Mm, 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 oh my god. Oh. oh, but yeah. Now we are getting some progress currently, finally. I still didn't really uh, figure it out this part over here. Um, I think that that one for some reason I will gonna leave basically seems like locks. Uh, but other than that, uh, we are pretty much almost done with this grid for defenses that it's gonna be over here. I hoping that when it comes to the base that we are gonna have more than enough space on this side. I think that it's gonna be pretty much decent space but I'm not really sure. And still need to figure it out where I want to make a bridge to the other side. Probably I do want to place, I don't know, definitely some kind of bridge to the other side. Oh Virginia, uh, oh my god. I think you do have some serious problem. Oh man, Virginia, Virginia. So, uh, yeah, I do need... We need, we need, I need, I need to replace this locks over here, which is kinda annoying, but this is uh, how I kinda work around. I'm gonna move this away. Finally. We're getting stones back, which is cool. Load these stones for me, uh, Kelvin. Boom. Okay. We are getting somewhere. Probably I do have a bit of problem over here, but this is something that uh, should be more that okay. We can get rid of those. Don't need it. And I think, oh uh, yeah, we just need to connect basically everything. Elvin, he's been pretty much busy these days, but that's okay. He's doing alright. 
Virginia, please stop it. Okay, so I think that uh, for this little little uh, pyramid, what pyramid? What pyramid? For a maze, uh, this is gonna be pretty much decent size. I'm not really sure if I'm gonna make so big this maze. Probably I'm gonna make smaller run on some point, but first we are gonna place floors inside. Just to see where we are, and I think that this side over here is gonna be pretty much them protected. Yeah. Uh, should I st yeah, start working? Place some floors down. Look okay, at me, I think that we need to make some lot lock hordes, probably with stones, so... Uh, well, I'm gonna still need a bunch of stones. But other than that... We need to gather some locks, yes, probably it's not really so bad idea. Mmm, 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 buddy! Stop a bit, eh? Uh, I know something just built... ...finished structure. Oh my god, uh, uh, Virginia, I, uh, I need to re reload, I need to fix it because it is getting annoying, Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I need to fix Virginia, oh she is damn broken, eh? Oh. Okay, nice to see Virginia, oh, she is back normal. I know that Kelvin is being very busy at this time, but you know something, Kelvin, I'm gonna need something from you. Oh, uh, we are gonna need a bunch of rocks. Uh, so just... Get some rocks and uh, fill holder. Because rocks right now, the smaller ones, they are kinda really really difficult to find. Especially now in the winter. <laughs> or can we, he can find, I don't know how. Uh, he must have some kind of GPS. Uh, anyway, in the meantime, I need to try to imagine this, uh, this maze. So for that, I'm just gonna make a simple grid, just to see how we can make basically everything. So I do need this one over here. Boom. So. Do need to make some changes right over here because here we're gonna place a gate. One more. Oh! Just that that little leave Kelvin alone. Okay. Oh Jesus, Kelvin. Just, okay, we shoot them, Virginia. Oh, yes, yes, nice. This little lizard. All right, buddy. Thank you, Virginia. You're the best. Jesus Christ. Okay. Now this is gonna be the hard one. Uh, so... I need to try to imagine... Kevin, I will write. No something, if I do like so... I need to see... I need to find a center which is gonna be a little bit difficult. Okay, so here is probably the center. At least I'm hoping. Yeah. It is a uh, center which is exactly what I needed. Uh, now this is gonna be a little bit harder to make all of this because I need to line it up with this uh, basically I'll line it up this uh, this locks kind of try to do straight line. I 
and we are getting straight line more or less now this is obviously if you're doing something like so the perfect uh, things to do virginia what are you doing it uh, obviously the jesus christ virginia obviously it is getting oh i almost uh did Uh, the problem is it is obviously lining up everything and we do have this arrow that I don't want it I do want block over there so definitely probably I'm gonna need to get rid also also this one here yeah. so basically I do need two locks over here all right uh, now I should be able to replace basically this is for here if I do remember, yes, nice, look at that, it is almost perfect, and I can still put on the top, which is something that I'm gonna need anyway, which is exactly what I needed, now this gate, just like I did say at the beginning, uh, and it's really perfect, because if you do like using this technique, you kinda better uh, to make this on the flat area, but it's gonna work in which is uh, exactly oh, which is basically what we need. Okay, let's put this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. One more stone. I need to make sure that. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> uh, try to be funny. Jesus Christ! Okay, let's open the door. Okay, finally. I need to open the door just to put some stones back. Sometimes you kinda need to play around to what you have. Uh, okay, open the door. After this sesamo, put the stones back. We are back in action. We can close this door. This is gonna be a really, really low door. Um, obviously, yeah. Well, it's not really a problem. Uh, but uh, you can already see what I'm doing. Boom. And I can remove this one, yes. This is gonna be perfect. Of course, I'm gonna expand the deck also over here. Just to make a little bit nice everything. Oh, <laughs> nice shot, Virginia. Uh, but yeah, I think that it's gonna be okay. I can probably, yes, I'm gonna make spikes. I know that this door that kind of a really, really low door, but okay, who cares? They are what they are. All right, this is a lot better. Winter, it's over finally, and we are making already some progress overall. I uh, basically did already. Place it down a couple of these stones just to make sure that uh, the pyramid is gonna. Why I send pyramid? Can we seriously? You you can open the door, eh? Look at that. It's not so difficult, eh? Or seriously, or you don't know how to open the door? No, obviously we do need to protect ourselves also against Lexi. So this is gonna be really high, uh, higher up pyramid. Pyramid again, I say pyramid, I know, what is wrong today with me? <laughs> uh, we need to make this maze uh, basically for two level high Otherwise it's not gonna work uh, against the biggest mutants uh, So there is of course a bunch of stones that we're gonna need uh, can we, I, I cannot believe he's stuck again He's getting stuck all the time in most uh, funny things really i don't know how is this even possible but yeah kelvin is kelvin you cannot really change kelvin and at this point i just want to place some spikes down so let's just place a couple of sticks down just like so i can still place these stones back 
I don't think that this is gonna be okay. Virginia, she is busy. Hello, sir. I think that you are on the wrong side, eh? Okay. I think it's time that I start making some bones. Hmm. Maybe it's a bad idea. I need to make some bone marker. Even if I don't really need bones right now. I'm gonna need fire. Uh, but just like I said, yeah, it seems like I can place the spikes after that and I'm gonna make... Uh, let's just test it out. This is higher enough, yes. I'm gonna make another line of these spikes, even if probably I don't really need more than, more than that, especially over here, because, uh, yeah, probably I'm not gonna really need it. Two lines. I'm gonna see after that. Man, this is so much faster now without animation, even if I still building all of this already, I don't know, for maybe it is day three already of building, uh, which is uh, still, it does take quite a lot of time and I didn't want to do that. But we are getting over there, uh, sooner or later we are gonna complete all of those. Yeah, this is gonna be probably more than enough spikes. Um, maybe I'm gonna make another line, but honestly, I don't think that I'm gonna need more. Oh, oh, for the fuck's sake, two Lexi. Oh, man. Oh, no, it's not Lexi. Who is the... Holy crap. Okay, I didn't see that one. Shoot them, Virginia. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Just use this samurai sword. Probably. For a second I was thinking it is Lexi, but no, it's not Lexi. It is some huge guy. I mean, after end game, this, this mutant there are changing. After you complete the game. This one, it doesn't attack me before, eh? Oh. Alright, the other things, I'm not entirely sure what kind of um, wall I want to make. This one or the other one. Obviously, if I do make this one, I can cover from over here, which is gonna be nice. But, yeah, I'm not really entirely sure. Maybe that one. Hmm, let me check really quickly. Probably I will go with this variation, even if that means that I'm gonna use more stones. Uh, but the things, it is damn simple. I will not even gonna fight on this level, this is where I'm gonna place all my traps. So basically probably this variation here it doesn't not make sense at all. Now if I do... Yeah, probably it's gonna be better, yeah. Let's just remove that. Probably it's gonna be better. Even if that means that I'm gonna need more time to complete this entire deadly maze. Hmm. I think this is gonna be a lot better, eh? this design, because at the end of the day, if I do this design all around, I can still, after that, I can still put on every single line, I can put some more spikes if I do need it or not. So this is something obviously that uh, we are gonna see after that. Uh, but for now, we are just gonna make like so. Definitely it's gonna be better. Alright, so I did already a couple of changes. Uh, I did decide that when it comes to the inside, I will just have this window so that way I can still shoot. Uh, however, I cannot really use the spears because I just hitting these uh, stones. So this is kind of downside. Now, I did raise up basically the outside walls. Just for one more line. I think that this is gonna be better. And on the very top, this is something that I need to figure out if it's gonna work or not. Uh, I'm gonna place some planks and see if the stream and wall. Uh, now the problem it is obviously uh, we're getting a bit low on locks and everything else. And I still need to connect this one, but uh, this one I can put even locks. I don't really need... 
to have stones over there. Hmm. I just need to test it out something, so we are just gonna connect. So I need to make sure that we can remove basically this lock, uh, that stone over there, after I put I put uh, planks down. So, uh, yeah, why not? I just remove a couple of this. I think it is right over there. Yeah. Now, technically speaking, I should be able to remove these stones over here. Yes, I can remove. Uh, no big deal. Seriously, Kelly, are you stuck again now on the other side? Oh my, oh my god, this is gonna take forever to gathering this, uh, these stones with Kelvin because... Okay, he's doing a great job, but he, he's getting stuck every single time. Jesus, Kelvin, I swear god, I'm gonna kill you one day. Oh, yeah, Virginia, I don't have time. Uh, let's just remove this one, and I can remove this one, which is gonna be okay, boom. Okay, I think that this river is worth really nice to transport all my logs. Maybe. I'm not really sure, but definitely, yeah, they are getting over there. Which is not really so bad. If they are... All of them or not, I'm not really sure, but... Other than that, I did this. Rope over here, I did... Kinda connect to my base. So it's kinda okay. And this is four, but I don't think that I'm gonna need more than that for now. And some locks I do have already over here, which is kinda oh oh right. Since that they not get to the lower part, at least I'm hoping. Everything so far seems works super great for this location. Now that locks they are stopping over there, which is uh, hmm. I don't know. Maybe I'm gonna make some kind of lock collector in the future. Because, uh, yeah, if they stop over there, this is uh, gonna be super perfect. I do have a whole, basically the entire forest on the top. I can clear, use this river to transport all my logs, and sooner or later they are gonna end up over there. If I don't do nothing, yeah. But over there they are stopped, so which is okay. complete this platform on top so I think that I need basically one more planks and uh, this part over here it is done now the obvious reason where I'm gonna make a stairs to the very top uh, I do consider basically make a stairs on the very back probably it's gonna be better that way hmm decision 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 Side, side, side. Definitely this side I need to close up just like every single other side, but... Over here I don't think that I do really need it. Basically I'm just gonna make fences, a race up. Just for one locks and just cover up. And have like a big window. So that way we can shoot some cannibals, mutants, every mutants we can. Uh, but this part it is still quite open and we do need to work on some traps. Oh, I do need to repair something. Yeah, yeah. I can put hell in all base management, but yeah. <laughs> it's not gonna work. Uh, I can already see that. Kevin, seriously, are you stupid? Look at that. There's enough room. Do I really need to put some spikes over here first so that way you can get around? It's gonna work that way. You're all bloody. What is wrong? Somebody hit you. It wasn't me for sure. Hmm. Man, I don't know. Uh, it seems like that I need to place some spikes, because if I do place spikes over here, uh, Kevin probably is gonna get around. Wanna see. This is getting 
annoying, really. I'm pretty damn sure of the canon that you should be already, already dead, but apparently no, you are immortal. This guy I don't know what are you gonna do with Kelvin. I need to figure out how to unstuck Kelvin all the time. Uh, I think that the developers should do something, I don't know, some kind of key that you can press, unstuck Kelvin, stuff like this. Because he's getting, I don't know, how he can get stuck over here. Seriously, Kelvin. I'm not sure how you can get stuck over here. Look at that, there's plenty of space. Even I can move in if it is Virginia over here, and you cannot move. What an idiot. Oh, we're gonna make our way to the very top, and we're gonna try to complete this section over here, and I will come back right after I complete all of this, because... Uh, uh, I don't know. Kelvin, for the fuck's sake. Okay. Sorry. I'm doing myself. Better. Uh, anyway, I just uh, started place it on the very top, basically the electro fences. Well, uh, this is obviously still not a fences. Uh, now the things it is uh, pretty simple. I just figured it out. Uh, you need if you do want to place obviously something like so. You need. Uh, you can basically place uh, these sticks on, on the planks. You cannot place uh, directly on the stones. So to get things around, you place down a planks, you put the sticks down, and you can snapping. After that, you just use a snapping point to place these sticks inside the stones. Uh, just like so. So this is what I'm currently doing. So that way we are gonna make a nice electro fence on very top. Uh, the reason why I do want to make this electro fences it is because of flexi, because they can jump pretty damn high up. Eh? I can now remove these spikes over here, no spikes, these sticks over here. I should be able to remove this over here. Okay, boom. I'm gonna replace stones back. Boom. Boom, boom. I'm gonna place obviously stones on the bottom and obviously this is gonna be a nice electro fences of course we're gonna use a lot of sticks a lot of stones some wire no wire it's not a problem uh but yeah uh, so far it's gonna look okay i uh, must say uh better than i was expecting well, obviously uh, without cannon, it's better that I was expecting, but yeah, I think that once we are gonna done, uh, it's gonna be amazing. Finally, after, I don't know, six days, I think that I'm building this uh, six days already, or maybe even seven, I'm not really sure. Uh, but finally, it is done. Now, probably I'm gonna make some changes in some future. Uh, I'm gonna probably expand this deck over here, kinda connect to this side. Uh, but overall, my deadly maze slash defense wall, it is kinda done. And definitely I'm pretty damn sure that nobody can, can get inside right now. I mean, pre this helicopter traps, can you survive? I think no. And of course there is some spikes, okay, I still need to place a couple of spikes. Uh, but so far, it seems that this is gonna be pretty much okay. Still missing a couple spikes on this side, but this is something that uh, I'll be just gonna edit later on. Obviously, the electro fences on the top, I think that this is gonna be this when it comes to the fences. Uh, so anyway, if you like what you see, smash the like button, leave some comments below, and subscribe to the channel if you like. And thank you so much for watching. And I will see you all on the next one. Bye, Umbisbald. Uh.